three, two, and boom! Oh my gosh! It is exactly what I ordered. Ladies and gentlemen, we have a stack of metal Pokemon cards. They are all silver. Oh my gosh! What's good everybody, Darkul here, back at it again with another video, and in today's video, ladies and gentlemen, the main star of today's video is this what metallic is Pokemon card box, guys. Check that out. It is literally shining on the camera, and it is pure silver, obviously. Not real silver, but the color is silver, it's metallic, and I cannot wait to showcase what's inside this box. Because let's just say, it's a little bit crazy, bro, and it does remind me of a certain card that does, in fact, exist. But before we get into all that, guys, we're gonna go ahead and open up some Pokemon card products as well as that strange little silver box. Now the products we're gonna go ahead and open up, the first one is none other than a Hoopa V box. Check that out in all its gloriness. And the second box we're gonna open up is none other than the Dragonite V collection box, and y'all know I love my dragons. So this is how it's going to go down. I'm going to go ahead, open up one box, and then I'm going to show you guys what is inside this silver box. And then we're going to go ahead and end things off with the Dragonite V-Box. So if you guys are excited for today's video, make sure you guys smash that like button right now. If you guys are new to the channel, make sure you guys subscribe and join the Go Army and welcome. And if you guys leave a comment down below, y'all already know the drill you feel me so without further ado let me go ahead and open up this hoopa box in lightning speed one eternity later all right guys so first things first we have the promo card that you guys can redeem in the online tcgo and then we have the hoopa v promo card itself which looks absolutely gorgeous you feel me so let's go ahead and sleeve this up and i am also going to be if i can even open up this sleeve bro there we go thank you and i'm also going to put this as the star of the show we're gonna go ahead and have a star of the show because why not even though we're not opening up as many packs but the pack selection on these boxes are nice bro we got fusion strike vivid voltage and evolving skies the packs are out of this world we're gonna go ahead and start things off with none other than vivid voltage so let's get it guys can we get that chunky funky pikachu my guy please we got a psychic energy and y'all already know my psychic powers tells me there is a hit in this pack so we got the homie rylu we got the sand dial and we got a Weedle, Shop It, followed by the Electrode Holographic. This is our first official pool, so I am going to have to remove the star of the show. But we got my boy Rayquaza up next, and y'all know that I am a huge, huge fan of the Pokemon itself, so let's get it, baby. Come on, we got that Lightning Energy, my guy. We got the Elemental Badge. We got a Shellgon, a fellow dragon type. We got a Fletchling, Chinchow, Petalil. We got a Hippo, and we got the Milotic regular rare. But we're now into the good stuff. Mew is all over the Fusion Strike set, and I don't think I've pulled any at all. So this right here is about to be insane i need a lot of cards from this set itself so like i said i'm hoping to pull anything that involves heat or anything that involves mew might i add so we got the panseer we got the gumi we got adventurer's discovery followed by the corviknight okay all right guys it's all good we got the mew pack itself let's see if we have some more heat in this 
Hoopa box. Let's get it. We got another upside down code for the ghoul army. Y'all got to work for them codes, bro. I'm giving out every single code card. The least y'all can do is work for them. We got the bug catcher. We got the glossifer, panpour, Eevee, Shinx, Shelmet, Clamperl, and the Latios regular rare. Unfortunately. Alrighty guys, so that right there was the first box. Literally just an electrode, but I normally don't have good luck with collection boxes anyway, so I'm not tripping. But now, the main reason why y'all are here. We have a silver Pokemon card box with Ash Ketchum on the front. We got a Pikachu and then we have another random Pikachu. Literally on the cover artwork for no reason, bro. Why is there a second Pikachu that looks like the vintage one and it looks like it's out of place, bro? So the back, same thing. We got Ash Ketchum, a Pikachu, and then we have the second Pikachu. But guys, are you ready to see what's inside this box? If this is what I originally ordered, it's gonna be absolutely crazy, guys. So let's get it. Three, two, and boom! Oh my gosh, it is exactly what I ordered. Ladies and gentlemen, we have a stack of metal Pokemon cards. They are all silver. Oh my gosh. Okay, so let me just say they're not completely metal because they might look like it, but they're still flimsy like a Pokemon card. I would say... They're basically the same, if not more flimsy than your average Pokemon card. But guys, look at that. We got the Zacian V silver card, I guess you can call it, but check it out. Look at the front. I love the texture, even though these are not official. Look at the back, bro. This is crazy. I was not expecting all of these cards from this box to be the same type of texture. Look how crazy that looks, bro. Oh my gosh, okay, hold on. Before we take a look at these cards themselves, let me just add that these remind me of the silver Dialga from Phantom Forces, bro. If you guys remember the card, you're an OG. If you don't remember, I will be putting it on the screen right now, just so you guys refresh your memory. But that's literally what these remind me of, guys. So check it out. Let's go ahead and see exactly what we're working with, guys. We got the Zacian. Oh my gosh, I still can't believe it. We got the Chunky Funky Pikachu, bro. That's crazy. We got a Charizard that doesn't even exist in the real TCG world. We got the Shiny Zard, bro. It is literally called Shining Charizard GX. We got a Lucha Pikachu. <laughs> <laughs> that's crazy we got the special delivery oh my gosh charizard v max charizard gx charizard v max again pikachu v i have no idea what this pikachu is if this is an actual card let me know in the comments down below because i honestly have no idea but let's keep it going oh my gosh we got a pikachu i believe this one is from sun and moon base Correct me if I'm wrong. But guys, this next card has to be some custom artwork, bro. Look at that Charmander in the middle. And both forms of Charizard are just like worshipping it. That's crazy. Look at the HP. 508 HP, bro. That's a little weird. I'm not gonna lie. We got the Charizard V full R. We got another Charizard. Another Charizard. We got the Umbreon and Darkrai. Oh my gosh, these are low-key beautiful. There is a ton of Charizards, bro. Look at this. Why is there so many Charizards? We got the Starters, Charmander, Squirtle, and Bulbasaur with the Pikachu on the bottom left. That's interesting. We got more Zard action, bro. Okay, now it's looking a little bit normal. We got the Flareon V, Pikachu, and Zekrom. Another Charizard, but in a different language. That's crazy. That is on. Oh my gosh. All of the vintage artworks in one. That's, I'm not going to lie. That's actually dope. We got a Pikachu Mega Sableye. 
That's beautiful right there. We got Mewtwo and me. We got more Charizards, bro. What is with this person and Charizards? They are literally everywhere. We got the Lapras, Grimmsnarl, Gardevoir, and Sylveon. We got the Mega Diancie cosplay with 700 HP. That's a strong Pikachu. And this one, look at that, bro. It has 634 HP. That's ridiculous. We have a ton of Pikachu cosplays, bro. I'm not gonna lie. These right here are probably my most favorite cards out of the bunch. We got Pikachu cosplays left and right. But guys, that right there is the end of the silver Pokemon cards. Look at that, bro. Literally every single card I basically saw in this video is completely silver. I'm not gonna lie, that's actually kind of unique. Even though Pokemon did it first. So check it out guys, this is literally a product that I just wanted to showcase because I saw it online and I was like, there's no way all of the cards are going to look like this. But check it out, they literally all look like that. I can use these as a mirror, bro. That's how bright and shiny they are. But enough about that, guys. Let me know what y'all think about these silver cards. I'm just going to go ahead and put them right there. And now, let's move on to the Dragonite V-Box. A few moments later. Alrighty, guys. So here is the code card for the Dragonite. And then here is the promo card itself. And that artwork is actually very, very, very nice. Dragonite is such a goat. But since this is a promo card, we're gonna go ahead and put it on the pool pile and let's move on to the packs themselves. And surprisingly enough, instead of having two packs of Fusion Strike, this one actually had a pack of Chillin' Rain, which is kind of unfortunate, but it's all good because I'm still actually missing a couple cards from this set itself so hopefully we can get some heat regardless or at least anything better than that holographic electrode i will be satisfied with so let's get it baby we got ourselves a vivid voltage pack featuring a celebi and i still can't get over the fact that all of these cards back here are silver are metallic i honestly do not know what to call them exactly, but let's just call them silver cards because that's what they remind me of. So we got the Sandile and the Lucario. Okay, so we got Evolving Skies. Can we get an Evolution, ladies and gentlemen? Can we get an Evolution or are opening up collection boxes absolutely not worth it? Let's find out because so far they are definitely not worth it. We got the Lotad, Teddy Ursa, we got a Nicket, Dwebble, and okay, so far they are definitely not worth it. Final pack from the second box, we have literally pulled nothing at all, bro. Literally nothing at all. So here is the code card, and let's get it. Four to the front, we got a Darkness Energy. We got a Dunsparce, the homie Dunsparce in the cut. We got a Stuffle, Sigilyph, Toxel, Totodile, and okay! Let's go ahead and put the focus back on these silver cards because those boxes were straight trash! You feel me? Both of them were trash, bro! But at least we have all of these hilarious, I'm not gonna lie, these cards are hilarious, but they are kind of interesting to look at i'm not gonna lie without further ado guys if you did enjoy today's video make sure you guys smash that like button right now and i'll catch y'all in the next one peace